Hi, this is Bob with Gibbs RV, and today we're looking at a 2002 Sundancer by Atasca. This is a double slide Class C motorhome on an E450 chassis. You can see the slide on the driver's side, as well as a bedroom slide on the passenger side. This thing is really, really loaded. It's got window awnings, it's got awning toppers, it's got a big awning, it's got satellite, it's got solar, it's got outside stereo, generator, the list goes on. Tires are good. No cracks. Still got the rubber nubbins. Alloy wheels. Real alloy wheels, not simulators. Lots of basement storage. You can see here. It's just got uh, lots of room to bring all the stuff along. Who says you can't bring it all with you, right? Back side here, we've got trailer hitch, rear rack, a couple tubes mounted on the exterior for uh, storing your sewer tube, and even a rear window cover. And here's the back side. You can see there's no body damage. Things pretty straight. It does have a couple issues. And that's why I'm doing this video. Uh, 161,000 miles in the coach. I'm going to just go up to the driver's door here. We can take a look at the uh, passenger compartment. I got a little bit of a tear in the seat. Passenger seat, pretty good. A little bit of a fray there. Uh, odometer, 161,000. You can see it's got tilt, cruise, cup holders, and let's take a look at the, the RV side of this coach. It's got the Ford V10, which is a, used in commercial vehicles, so still got a whole lot of life left in it. Double step, electric steps. Got a little stain on the carpet. We ran a shampooer here and it didn't quite come all the way out, but boy, you can see how that slide really gives you a lot of room. And up front, it's an entertainment model. So you, instead of having the bed up here, you've got the big TV. Lots of room for all the electronics to fit in here. See how that opens. Well, a little smarter than me. Kind of hard to do one-handed. You can see lots of room for storage. Here's a view of the passenger compartment from above. Of course, we got an extra bed when you lay this uh, dinette down. And the older feller that had it, here's just a list of some of the things that he's done to it. The extras that he's added, uh, even have the original brochure, the dinette, or uh, galley, I should say, consists of the three burner stove, oven underneath, double basin sink, microwave, or speakers throughout this. We have a main control panel right here to test all of your controls, your tanks, that sort of thing. The refrigerator, it's got wood fascia on it, it's a Norcold. And slide out pantry, that's nice. You don't have your canned goods laying all over when you get to your destination. We got a glass faced shower here, fiberglass stall with a skylight over the top. And in the bedroom, boy, that slide just makes a ton of difference. You can see all this room in the wardrobe storage we've got here. There's a writing desk with a mirror on it. You could use uh, for cosmetics, that sort of thing. Got a lighted closet. Now the issue part. You notice there's a little wrinkle in the wallpaper. It's soft here and here, both sides. It's leaked within. You wouldn't know it looking at it until you get real close and final inspection, but it is. Um, we've got just all kinds of storage here. If you're a handyman, you can fix this wall and we're selling it accordingly. So give someone a real break on a nice little class C motor home, about half of book value. It's a Gibbs RV. It's a 2002 Sundancer by Itasca. 1-800-824-4388. See us on the web at www.gibbsrv.com in Coos Bay.